A scary situation unfolding for shoppers at a Delaware mall this afternoon after a person is shot inside. And Dave, you p spoke with some people who were there. It had to be pretty scary. Not what you Yeah. Yeah, we spoke exclusively with a woman who was inside lockdown while this all took place. Of course, it's all quiet now, the Concord Mall behind me. But earlier, just hours earlier, this place was flooded with police cars and police looking for a suspected shooter. Right now, we're all on phones, talking to our family, some people crying, laughing, just trying to keep each other cheered up. A woman named Shayna talking with Fox 29 while on lockdown inside the Sprouts grocery store at the Concord Mall in Brandywine 100 North Wilmington as police respond to a reported shooting on the shopping campus Friday night. Our store manager was notified that there was an active shooter. Next thing I know, customers, employees all started going to the back of the store. Delaware State Police cars swarmed the shopping center on Concord Pike, shutting down all entrances to the mall while they investigated and Shanna's dad waited for a word outside. I want my daughter out and I want her home safe. But uh, I know that they're here to do what they have to do, but at the same time, knowing that your loved one is there and they're helpless. Sources say at least one person was shot in what's being called a targeted attack. Police say there's no threat to the public. We spoke to a store owner who saw the victim being helped. I heard uh, the shot and I just popped out and I went to by the by the door. I see the, the, his friend carrying him out and then I see his, his leg is bleeding. I think he got shot in the leg. The shooting happened as some were showing up for work at the mall. Some workers say they were left in the dark. As soon as I walked in, everybody was telling me what happened and I was like, well, why are we still here? Why am I coming into work if there was a shooter and they can't find him? Meantime, those on lockdown like Shanna say they were glad not to be alone. All we know is that we're safe and we're okay. And we can tell you that sources are saying the suspect took off on foot. Meantime, Delaware State Police say they will release more information once they get this all sorted out. Don.